Alright, how's it going, everyone? Welcome to uh, Guardians of the Galaxy, the Telltale series. Um, it's not really something that I anticipated to come up soon, and I know that I still have like a lot of uh, games to do. I still have to finish up Mass Effect, Horizon Zero Dawn, and Zelda, which is going to take like hundreds of hours. But um, this popped up. I didn't know it was coming out this soon. And uh, it's only, it should only take like two hours, so I thought I'd just take a little break from everything else and uh, hop on the train. Um, Guardians of the Galaxy is, a, I don't know, I think it's a fantastic movie. The second one's coming out in like a month or so, so that's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, that's uh, all I really have to say about that, <laughs> but... Um, I'm I'm looking forward to what will hopefully be a humorous adventure. Hopefully something like Tales from the Borderlands. Not that I have anything against the more serious toned Telltale stuff like Batman or The Walking Dead, which I actually have. I think there, isn't there like a Walking Dead season three? Maybe I should do that at some point. I haven't actually even uh, bought the game, so I don't know if I'm gonna do that or not. But nothing so nothing against seriously seriously inclined uh telltale stuff but i enjoy humor every once in a while and all all the games i'm playing right now none of them really have like humor i mean like mass effect has like some quips but it's it's it's, it's overall just meant to be like a serious ish game uh horizon zero dawn same thing breath of the wild doesn't really have dialogue so it's just you immersing yourself in this giant world doesn't matter um, I haven't played games in a while, if that makes sense. Uh, <laughs> it's been really busy. Uh, last time I, like, sat down for a recording session was probably about a month ago. Um, at which point I went on vacation to Hawaii, and then, uh, my girlfriend from out of town was in, in town, so I was doing that, and then I was doing, uh, <laughs> more work. Basically, just been really busy all around, and I apologize about the lack of uploads as a whole, but I will uh, do my best to uh, fix that. I don't know if that's something that really needs fixing, but I want to improve it. There you go. So hopefully this game has like a similar tone to the movie, because that would be great, because I love the movie. <clears throat> Maybe it'll have a dope soundtrack. We're off to a good start here. Okay. Here's the thing. It's probably copyright, so I should probably uh, go ahead and do the thing. Okay, so it's five episodes as normal, as usual. I played. I think the only one that actually had six episodes was Game of Thrones. Which, now that I think about it, I actually never finished. Which is really weird. I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why I never finished Game of Thrones. It probably just. Did I do four? I want to say like episode five came out and I just didn't know about it and I never got around to it, but enjoy the copyright music because it's probably going to be copyright. So here we go. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. Guardians, this is the Nova Corps. We have a situation. Thanos is here. Destroyer of Worlds, big glowy gauntlet, wrinkly chin. Yeah, I've heard of him. You have to help us. This is a priority one distress call, Star-Lord. I know we rarely ask for your assistance, but we're desperate. Sounds like fun. Where is his voice from? Count me in. Where do I know his voice Thank from? You. <clears throat> the Nova Corps is in your debt, Star-Lord. Ah! Okay. Here's the situation. We tracked Thanos to this Kree planet, but when our fighters engaged, he decimated our fleet. Without your help, he'll kill us all. We're no match for him. Half our ships are already gone. We've set up a defensive position around the planet, but we can't hold out for long. You got it, space cops. Be right there. The Guardians 
are on it. Uh, thank you, Scarlord. <laughs> Please hurry. So, like, are we established as a team? I don't know, like, what the time frame for this is supposed to be. Time to rock and roll. So this is, is this like supposedly after the first movie where everyone's like, hey, we're a jolly old team. Oh, wow. This is the thing. I know I could turn off the music if I don't want to worry about copyright, but... Peter! I'd rather... Looks like death out there. Business as usual. I'm not complaining. I'd rather keep the music on and take the copyright notice. Heads up. So I wonder if they're like more based off the comics here, because they didn't they didn't model him after making out to help me before we explode. They didn't model him why is it so fucking loud? I can't hear a thing. It's actually incredibly loud. I I don't know how loud it is for you, but like it's very, very loud for me, so I apologize. Quick, Thanks, Yumi. You're welcome. So that, and fixed. <coughs> the next disaster. So and they, that is <laughs> where to begin. Rusters fried, compilers spitting out carbon. Oh, and now Groot's on fire. Groot's on fire. Peter. <laughs> I got you, man. Groot. I am Groot. You're welcome. Oh, Groot says thanks. I, I got that. Oh, wait. I speak Groot. If you're all here, who the hell is flying my ship? Drax. Or nobody. This is a large ship. Whoa, 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 Drax! Do not distract me, Star-Lord. Thanos is here. Today, I finally slay our nemesis. My dead wife and daughter shall have their vengeance. I have longed for this day of death. Dreamed of it. Hey, I'm all aboard the Vengeance Train, okay? But let's worry about not getting killed before we kill him. We're on a spaceship, not a train. Move, Drax! Oh, yeah, the literal part, yeah. Wow, they, like, modeled the ship after Thanos. I was enjoying myself. Yeah, well, I'd enjoy you shutting up, okay? Off to a great start today. I am Groot. Mm. So, like, I, I haven't had a chance to say it because they've been talking a lot, but, like, did they model the characters after the comics? Because in the movie, I think Gamora has, like, red hair or something, right? All right, guys. Something like that. Show you how it's a lot of grunting. The song was definitely copyright, but it's okay. No problem. I am Groot. Uh, no. No. That was absolutely not fun, you stupid log. Uh, anybody dead? <sighs> okay. Good. Where is the other green one? Uh, wishing we had better seatbelts. Still breathing. Cool. Ah, the famous press E to win. Ow. Oh no! Get me down! Get me down! My sweet, precious little baby! There's an infant on our ship. Well, that can't be good. Where is it? Where is it? Pig! Get down here! I mean, up here! Whatever! Little arms. 
You need a hand there, little buddy? Your powers of observation are phenomenal. We're all gonna be red paste in a second if you don't help me. Careful with that. Am I supposed to hold S? My baby, give it! Come on. <laughs> Another nanosecond, and we all would have been atomized. Still looks like it'll blow up to me. It sure ain't no toy. We get pushed around by a lot of dangerous jerks. I built this bad boy to push back. <laughs> ain't she a beaut? She's still a little unstable. I like the way your brain works. Me too. <sighs> I got so you. This is how I die. Might as well go out on your own terms, you know? The mad titan arrives. He is heading towards those ruins. Ruins? Looks like the Nova Corps failed. It's up to us to take him down. Just the five of us. Yes. And that gun. <laughs> Alright, so how's the gun going to come into play? Is the question. My other que uh, bleh, other question is: Are we only going to play as tangled tangled up in blue? Are we only going to play as the uh, Star Lord slash Thanos. what's his name? Peter. Peter. There. I'm pretty sure it's Peter. I smell his evil stench. Or are we going to rotate? Probably not. door is not gonna budge so easily. <laughs> yeah, it will. Okay, so this gun ain't totally, you know, operational yet. And it only has one shot. But think of it as a feature. Yeah. I mean, you can't harness enough energy to atomize a biggish moon or smallish planet without some drawbacks. Okay. We'll find another way in. Thanks for understanding, Pete. I'll make sure you're not in the blast radius when this sucker finally goes off. What? I I get this feeling that Let's there's going to be a quote-unquote important decision regarding a said gun at some point. That'll be like, shall we shoot the gun? And we'll be like, yeah. I... And then he'll try to shoot it, and it won't do anything. Okay. Oh, we're supposed to look up there, but let's look at Drax first because we're a weirdo. Well, you tried, Gold Star. But we're going up there. I think I see a way over. Tread lightly, Star Lord. How did you get over here? Thanos must not detect our presence. Coming from I'm the guy who's been all. standing at the door going, ur, 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 ur. I know that hurts my throat. <clears throat> Press E and Q. I just pressed E once and it did it for me. What the fuck? What was that? Oh, hey. Easy there, Shifty. Tread lightly. So I'm supposed to hold W? Okay, yep. That's a Nova Corp ship, because I see in the movie. I think. Right? Nova Corp? The Corp? Nova Corp? Star Lord, what do your red eyes see? Subtle. Peter? Peter, are you injured? Say something. No, no, that was uh, totally part of the plan. Definitely did not almost die. Whatever you gotta tell yourself. Are we like a couple, or are we just like good homies? Hmm, probably didn't want to do that. But, we'll see. <sighs> what happened? Did you 
find the Nova Corps? Yes. Yeah. Um. They're all dead. Hang on. I'll find you guys a way through. Drax, pick up. Hello, Peter. So, who do you think built it? Oh, hang on. Oh, pff, you could just Damn, cut him off. Creeped out. Drax, what do you require of me? What can you tell me about Thanos? Years ago, I had a wife named Hovat and a daughter named Camaria. Due to Thanos's madness, they now rest in a place. Where I cannot visit, but I, Drax the Destroyer, will grant them the vengeance they deserve. Wonder who you were. Okay, very insightful. Maybe we'll just listen to the platform. Sounds like Thanos is already down there. I wonder if we're actually. Why, why is the Q and E? Hey, Gamora. What is it, Peter? What? Don't give me sass. Info about Thanos. Unfortunately, I do. Being raised by a monster, you learn firsthand of the darkness that lives within them. Thanos exists solely to impress death, to rule the galaxy unopposed. We would be wise to prepare for a battle unlike any other. It's a little dark. Was this damage in the fight, or is it supposed to look like this? Weird. <laughs> Maybe I'm just supposed to go touch that switch. You took a hell of a hit. Yeah. Yes. Oop. Like, I guess I'll just go check out the switch because nothing else is doing anything. I don't know. I already listened to the platform. This is this looks important, so Man, I broke the hell out of this thing. Did we? Okay. Maybe okay, I don't know. <laughs> Look at the door itself. It seems too obvious. How's it look from over there, Peter? This <coughs> thing is really solid. I'm gonna need something heavy duty to punch through. Well keep looking. We're counting on you. Oh, how about we just turn on a ship and then steer it towards the door? Eh? That could work, yeah? That's like a thing, right? Looks like the Nova Corps made an emergency landing. Right through a wall. Kind of looks like my landing. Where is... His, who is the voice actor? Ooh. Hey, now. That could do some damage. You there? What's up? What's going on over there, man? I found a crashed Nova Corps ship. Right smack through the wall. Ew. Ouch. Yeah. <coughs> I think its guns can blast the door open, but I can't get into the cockpit. Check the side. Should be an access override panel. I, uh, might have stripped one of these ships for parts before. Sure. Found the panel, but I can't get it open. Hit yeah, it. Yeah, you're gonna need an override chip to access it. God damn it, I have to find the bot. High-ranking officers usually carry them. Maybe I can figure out who was in charge. Well, I've got the time scanner. The what? 